Evaluate the integral from 10 to 13 of 2x dx. So we, what we've got here is to integrate from 10 to 13 of 2x d, dx. Now the formula for integration, if you're integrating between two limits a and b of x to the n dx, is x plus the power plus 1 divided by the new power, n plus 1 from a to b. n cannot be equal to minus 1, otherwise you're going to be dividing by 0. Now, what is the geometrical interpretation of this? Well, if we draw a set of axes from x and y and draw the line y is equal to 2x, so that's a line with a gradient of 2, what you're trying to do when you're working out this integral is you're trying to work out this area here between 10 and 13 under the line and the x-axis. OK, back to the integral. So n is equal to 1 in our case, so we've got 2x to the 1. So it's going to be 2x, we're applying this formula here, we're going to be 2x to the 1 plus 1, and then you need to divide by the new power, which is 1 plus 1, between 10 and 13. So the 10 and 13 now come down here. So this is now going to be equal to 2x to the squared divided by 2, from 10 to 13. Notice that the 2s cancel out, or so cancel those out. And we now get this left with x squared to the, from the 10 to 13. Now what you do is you substitute 13 in here. And that gives the area from some arbitrary, arbitrary point up until 13. So it's going to be 13 squared minus the area from, from uh, 10 squared, which is the area from some arbitrary point up until 10. So subtracting the 2 will give me the area between the two. 13 squared is 169. And 10 squared is 100. 169 minus 100 is 69 square units. Okay, so this has been a video to show you how to evaluate the integral from 10 to 13 of, of the line y is equal to 2x between 10 and 13 and its geometrical meaning, i.e. the area underneath the curve. I hope you found this video useful. Thank you very much for watching.